Oh, Snake Man. Alright, so we figured that out. Snake, snake Man should be a grass navvy. Oh, and of course, Snake, snake Man's all the way up the back. But I'm going to test out the pattern first, see... Come on, Snakey. Come on, hover. Hover, hover towards the light. I'm gonna t but I'm gonna test out Sea of Snake Man. I should, I should always be saving before. I never do. I never do. And that's the sin. Yep, he is. He, he is a. He is a fire. He is a fire. He is a grass navy confirmed. Oh, 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 no, now you attack. Now you attack from this direction, you crap, you bugger. Oh, nice. Well... There we go. That was an easy fight, but it can be even easier if I don't have... I'm sorry how these battles are turning out, so I didn't expect. It definitely proves that the Meteor chips were a lot more ba better in Mega Man 3. But, they, but again, again, my only purpose for using the Meteor chips was to kill the final boss in Mega Man. But it might be able to beat Gospel because of his size, but yeah, if you're fighting the final boss, definitely have Meteor chips prepared because they are meant to lock on to the enemies.
time bomb chip. That is perfect. Uh, oh, that's that's not that's not the that's not the bloke I'm looking for. And there's Edge Lord once again. Because I can at least use the um, I mean, if I buy those unblocker chips, the, the unblocker chips are usually. Figure out how to get that super program advance. The next day. Morning, Mega Man. Morning, Lan. You up early this morning. Yeah. Let's go to that official net battlers meeting. 